step by step of me painting the Golden Gate Bridge. Before I start talking about how I painted it, I was thinking to give you guys my first fun fact about the Golden Gate Bridge. The construction began on January 5th, 1933, and the reason why they built the bridge is for San Francisco Bay to the Pacific Ocean. The very first thing that I needed to get was a big white canvas and paintbrushes. Then I looked online for pictures of the Golden Gate Bridge and decided on one so I could recreate it. The third step I did was draw it with a pencil so I have a vision of what it would look like. After I drew it, I started making all the colors of the bridge and ocean and etc. This is what my canvas looks like after I drew my vision with a pencil. Then I started to paint the bridge with a rusty red and I also put a little bit of orange because of the sun is reflecting on the bridge. Here is a other picture of what my painting looks like now with the bridge painted. Why did I want to do this painting? One of the main reasons as to why I wanted to do this painting is because three years ago my mom went to San Francisco and the, she is the one who gave me the idea. What I would do differently if I would do it again. If I would do it again, I would take my time because when I do other paintings, I like to take my time because for this painting, I really did not take my time. And normally when I do take my time, the painting is way nicer. And I would also use my other paintbrushes because for this project I used my really old paintbrushes when I probably should have used my new ones. What was my favorite part of my project? My favorite part of the whole presentation was painting the Golden Gate Bridge because for me painting it is my favorite thing to do and if I could I would paint every day. It was also fun because at first I thought I would not be able to do this but I gave it a try. Why did I choose this topic? I chose this topic because it has it has been a very long time since I have painted and I also wanted to try to paint this to see if I would be able to paint this painting. I also did this because personally I love doing painting projects because like I said I love painting and these are the reasons why I chose this topic. How did my project change over time? As you saw the pictures of my painting over time, it changed a lot because I also added a lot of sunlight and a lot of details. How long did it take for me to do my painting? For my painting, it took about six hours and I finished it in a day. My other fun facts about the Golden Gate Bridge. Also, did you know they have uh, to frequently repaint it due to the fact that there is salt in the air because of the amount of salt that is in the ocean? And uh, the Golden Gate Bridge is a mile long. Another fun fact is the suspension bridge was considered engineering marvel. It uh, was their longest suspension bridge until 1964. The bridge's orange color significantly intended just as a primer. To cross the Golden Gate Bridge in 1937, it cost 50 cents each way. Also, they first had the idea of the bridge in 1872. Another reason why they chose orange for the color is because there is lots of fog in the area so it helps to reduce boat accidents. The Golden Gate Bridge has two main towers that support the two main cables. The height of the tower above water is 746 feet. And my last fact is that the weight of the bridge is 894,000 tons. This is my final product of my painting. I hope you enjoy my presentation. Thank you.